Krista Wolf's Was Blight is a deeply introspective and contemplative work that explores the nature of memory, identity, and the complexities of human existence. Through a fragmented narrative structure and introspective monologue, the author delves into the protagonist's struggle to reconcile her past and present, as well as her place within the larger historical and political context. The novel begins with the main character, a middle-aged woman named Anna, examining her life through a series of introspective reflections. She questions her own identity, wondering how much of her past experiences she can truly remember and how much has been lost to time. This theme of memory and its fallibility is central to the novel, as Anna grapples with the fragmented nature of her own recollections. Through Anna's introspections, Wolf also explores the broader themes of personal and collective memory. Anna grew up in East Germany during the Nazi regime and later lived under the socialist government, and she reflects on the erasure of history and the manipulation of memory during those times. She contemplates the ways in which personal narratives can be shaped and distorted by political ideologies, highlighting the tension between individual and collective memory. The narrative structure of Was Blight mirrors the fragmented nature of memory itself. The novel is composed of short, episodic chapters that are disconnected from one another, reflecting Anna's fragmented recollections. The disjointed narrative mirrors the protagonist's struggle to piece together her past and create a coherent sense of self. This fragmentation also mirrors the broader historical context, where events and memories have been distorted or erased by political forces. Wolf's writing style in Was Blight is introspective and contemplative. The novel is filled with long, meandering sentences that mimic Anna's train of thought, as she delves into the depths of her memories and emotions. Wolf's prose is lyrical and evocative, creating a sense of introspective intimacy that draws the reader into Anna's world. The language itself becomes a tool for exploring the complexities of memory and personal identity. One of the key themes in the novel is the tension between personal and collective responsibility. Anna grapples with her own guilt and complicity, both as an individual and as part of a larger society. She reflects on her role as a citizen in East Germany and her participation in a system that perpetuated injustices. This exploration of guilt and responsibility adds another layer of complexity to the novel, as Anna struggles to reconcile her past actions with her present self. In conclusion, Krista Wolf's Was Blight is a profound exploration of memory, identity, and personal responsibility. Through its fragmented narrative structure, introspective prose, and contemplative themes, the novel invites readers to reflect on their own relationship with memory and history. Wolf's work serves as a powerful reminder of the fallibility of memory and the complexities of individual and collective identities in the face of political and historical forces.